Hello, and welcome to our tutorial on how to create a post for LinkedIn and what features come along with it. Let's start creating a new post. On LinkedIn, you can publish the following types of content. A status, which is also known as text post, an image post with text, a video post with text, a gallery post including multiple images, and a link post. Let's create an image post. You can either upload the media from your device or select it from the media library. Create your copy, add emojis, use hashtag presets, shorten your links, as well as restrict your audience based on language or geographical location. If you want to tag business profiles, write at sign and start typing the name of the LinkedIn business profile. This action will open a drop-down menu with profiles to choose from. If the profile does not appear in the menu, Open the URL of the LinkedIn profile and copy the profile's unique URL name behind the company. Tagging personal profiles is currently not possible due to LinkedIn's API restrictions for third-party applications. In case this changes, we'll let you know straight away. You also have the option to write a first comment that will be posted alongside your post. Simply slide on the toggle and insert your text. Throughout the whole post creation process, your post's live preview will be displayed on the left side of your screen. The preview shows exactly how your post is going to look when live. You can also easily switch between a desktop and mobile view. Once your post is ready, it's time to set up its publishing date and time. In the post creation process, you also have the option to add a boost budget for the post. This value serves only for informative purposes for you and your team. Moreover, you can use labels for your posts for better organization. Either choose one of your existing labels or create a new one by simply typing it. Lastly, Contentino allows you to leave an internal note for yourself or your colleagues about the post in the notes field. Simply tag your colleagues by typing at sign. Once finalized, click the save button and the post will appear in the calendar on the planned date. In case you create a post without a publishing date, the post will be saved as a post idea. You will be able to view and access it in the left navigation panel of the calendar. If you're satisfied with everything and the post requires no further actions, click Schedule. And that's it! In case you have any questions or need our assistance, feel free to reach out to us. Thanks for watching and happy scheduling!